Hi everybody, welcome to another video here on the channel. Let's talk about these tags for the Spring of Sorrow. In game at the moment, you've probably seen these various different uh, tags for the objectives. And it's getting, it's getting a bit much, I think, uh, with the setup of this. And players are, you know, quite, I'd say, in their own right to be annoyed about the way that this is... Um, being played out. TLDR, confusion, leading to people using teams that, based on how they've read it here, are causing confusion. Now, if you're not English, if you're, if you're not kind of understanding English, if you're not understanding this, then I can imagine that other countries uh, and other languages, if it's not spelled out in a certain way or it's clear, I think it could be a little bit worse. But in any case, uh, if anybody remembers, like, uh, Winter of Woe last time, the gauntlet was set out in a certain way of, like, don't use this type of class, but... Uh, Yes, you can tell this is not for this. I am actually working um, as we as we're kind of like doing this video uh, on my Spring of Sorrow uh, options guide. It's it's not done. These aren't the champions to use, by the way. They're just there for for reference and also guiding um, on how I'm building this spreadsheet out. Uh, but these all need to be removed because they're not correct. Okay, uh, to kind of just clarify uh, that. But obviously, for the purpose of this being. I'd say simple in the way you execute any type of communication is important. And that is not, that's not what's happening with this. There have been a multitude of pop-ups or threads currently where players are ultimately confused about the way that Kabam have set things out or how they uh, perceive it to be read. And again, as I said, like depending on the country, depending on what language you speak, it could be uh, a bit worse. Um, and this is because okay, so this is a story right here. So JGD said, "Hi, I just did a completion of the Spring of Sorrow Gauntlet and the team of Hercules, uh, Odin, Vox, all Cosmics, or are the 2021 to 2024 Vox's Clarity? I should have gotten three points for them, but only got the points of Cosmics and Clarity. Uh, did I do something wrong?" And that is the tricky thing, isn't it, as to what's right, what's wrong. There could be a bug going on at the moment, there, but it could be the way that it's uh, ultimately um, explained. I mean, Demonus says right here, I'm almost positive that they include the or in, caption, uh, in capitals is because you have to use champions strictly from that year. Your team would have, uh, be, would, would have be all from that particular year. And again, it's, we're arguing a lot of the semantics of it, and I think that it's important for um, uh, for Kabam to give at least some kind of clarity as to like, well, what's what's going on with it. I had the same problem. Uh, Kabam needs to stop putting uh, too many tags with or, uh, and that's yeah, definite. I, I think that's the that's the case, because then it means uh, guide creation becomes a little bit uh, well weird for, for myself and many other you know content creators as to like well we have to be certain because at the end of the day if you're not certain and you get it wrong and, it, and people are investing a large amount of uh, uh, resources into it then it's um yeah disappointing I and mean, somebody said here is it repertoid repertoid there says um wouldn't make any sense i got the tech or cosmic objective using hercules serpent and future ant-man so you know, it gives you a bit of a perspective that people are able to get some stuff um, done. And this is some specific thing. Just did all 2021 uh, champs and same thing. I did all Cosmic and 2021 uh, champs just in case or didn't actually mean or. But it doesn't seem to matter unless I missed something else. And uh, just going into a bit there. And, and yeah, I think a lot of it's just... Oh, it's an issue. So this is an issue. This is an issue. It is under investigation. You should be able to use any champ within that uh, range. We'll have more information soon. So that's that's coming from Kabam at the moment uh, on that one. But that's, it's like, yeah, I'm get, getting a little bit kind of annoyed with the extent of these tagging. Um, it being, a, you know, just so, just, just weird, isn't it? Like, Kabam have to be sure about this stuff. Because as I said, people are investing resources. And they want to be certain when they're investing their time into it that they're actually getting something out of it. And it's not like they have to then wait around for compensation. Some people may be waiting around for compensation. That could be getting the deathless vision piece that a lot of people were sought out uh, to get. 
Likewise for myself, I'm more looking towards a way to kind of get this done without without kind of having to do it multiple times. Uh, just because I, I, I really am never interested in a lot of the time these types of content kind of like done in this particular way. I did like last time. Last time I felt that uh, the way that it was don't use this class or don't use that class or don't use this or don't use that or find a different way meant that it was like um, in some ways a fair approach. But I'm sure that a lot of people would say it may be unfair. I guess it depends on what your roster strength is, what your coverage is. Because last time uh, you could get away with a, a quite... Um, interesting uh, concoction of a team uh, obviously some of the champions this time aren't exactly the most fairest uh, in the world of marvel contest of champions and of course from a boss building perspective uh, they're not exactly the most fairest uh, as well but i suppose you get a larger breadth of roster to then tackle against them so i guess that's a thing um, as well but many people like it's not just that like there are um, obviously people are missing points um, I think it's a 2021 year tag must be the issue then. So yeah, that's um, that's really that. I'll try and include a few threads where people are using like teams or what like you know, um, bad team options for two runs. Herc, Odin, Mega Sentinel. Anyway, um, I was thinking I don't want to say bad bad team. Is that a bad team? I don't know, it just depends on how you choose to kind of like take in and what side you're going in and doing. But at least you get these options to kind of like dip in and dip out of what you actually choose would be interesting. You know, Metal Sonic do maybe live streaming at this moment in time. Use Serpent, Shocker and Gladiator for left side. Got him four objectives. I uh, think he's skipping skill science objective in favor of the year objective for right side. So I suppose that's another option or kind of a way to look at it. I don't know if there's like a one grace point. I'm trying to think about like, do you get two points for the 100 percenting and then you get a further... No, I think that's probably it, isn't it? Like, maybe you can miss an objective. I haven't really kind of calculated too much, especially if you... Well, if you do calculate, what have we got here? So we've got six objectives. One, two, three, four, five, six... Uh, six plus the two, isn't it? You get two for doing the um, a completion and exploration. So that could be eight points, which at least allows you to kind of pick and choose that you don't have to do uh, one particular um, objective. Maybe that's the case uh, to go, well, I can leave one objective, uh, but I still have to do the right side. I still have to do both paths. And that's going to be a key thing, like 100%ing it to get something out of it. I don't think you get something for 100%ing it. Um, but uh, maybe you don't get another point. Maybe you do. Maybe you don't. I need to kind of like go into actually kind of like figure if that's that's the case with a kind of a grace point. But if you do, then that could be an advantage to go. Well, you don't have to. You don't have to go like all points deep in one side. You can just like wait um, if that's uh, the case. And yeah, that's that's really it. Like I think. Again, looking at what Hercules, Hulkling, and uh, Deathless King group right path, no point. No point. I, I, yeah. It said 2021, 2022, or 2023. So uh, yeah, just a, it's just an explanation, isn't it? I think a lot of people just want to get that uh, explanation of what, are right, what is right, what is wrong, uh, and also are they making a mistake or, or is it going to be fine if they approach it in a certain way? Um, but yeah. Like, that's really it at the moment. It doesn't look, it looks like to be a, bu a bug or a problem, uh, which Kabam are looking to address. I suppose we just got to find out now if there's going to be any compensation for those that have lost out for the investment of going in uh, or a compensation of the point. So, yeah, watch this space. But I thought I'd do a quick video just to let you know there might be a bit of an issue at the moment with the 2021 element to this. Uh, and if there's any more updates, I'll let you know. But in any case, check out some other content located on screen. And I'm going to work on a guide, uh, but also a little kind of reminder about why you don't have to do the content right away. And farm revives and health potions to help yourself out as well. Thanks for watching. See you soon. Bye-bye.